Welcome back, Architects of the Wasteland, to the next episode in my Let's Build of Tuffington Greenhouse. In between videos, uh, I had kind of a glitch. Um, it was not actually caused by Bethesda and Fallout. It was a Steam glitch that hid all my saves. And uh, also made it so that I couldn't recover a few of them. One of which was uh, right after last video where I put these roads down. And I had to come back in and do it all over again. <laughs> it took me like three or four tries to, to get it going. Um, to get everything to line up the way it was supposed to. And here we are. Uh, so I decided that, uh, or I should say you all decided that we're going to keep the roads. And overwhelming majority of the people said leave them be. So, uh... I did just that. I put them back in, and it actually came out a little better this time. Um, I think uh, before these were these uh, telephone poles were actually kind of like almost in the middle of the sidewalks here, and so now they're actually a little bit off to the side, so that uh, that works out. Uh, but pretty much everything else is exactly the same. I've got it uh, lined up right in here, and even all the way back over in here. Uh, we can never make our way over there. We <laughs> got it looking a lot better as well. And I decided, um, you know, my OCD, and uh, I guess you guys all decided that your OCDs uh, can all take a back seat to this, and we're just going to kind of work with it, and we'll figure something out. So uh, if we look over here, just kind of blends in. I kind of played around with this, doing some different things, and I just, I don't know, I couldn't figure out what to do. If I got rid of this section of road, then that made that section of road look kind of funky, and so I just said, you know what, it is what it is. It's fine. So, um, the only other thing that is different is I put some more of these, uh, posts in place, and, um, that's pretty much about it. Just kind of, uh, make it look a little better and a little more uniform, I guess, and so we're gonna go from there. And, uh, I haven't decided yet if we're going to get rid of these steps, um, I'll let you guys uh, vote for a little bit longer to see if, uh, we decide to end up keeping them or not. So, we are going to work on this, and that has been bugging me for the longest time, and so we're going to jump right into that, um, and right over to G2M Construction, and let's see, Pier Beach, we don't need, we need floors, we need a face like that. So, um, I'm going to be putting an entire building around this, and we are actually going to have a water wheel type Thing that supplies power to it, or at least uh, appears to, anyway. So, let's see. We are going to use... Uh, not barn. Maybe get out of G2M. Let's see. What do we have here? Maybe let's just go right into USO and structures, and I think we're going to be using warehouse textures, maybe. I think that's going to be a little more fitting. Um, so, let's put a door... Here, bar. Make sure it's facing the correct way, which it is not. Now it is. Cool. And do, 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 do. we're gonna make it look like this thing's been here for quite a while. Right, right. All right. So we're gonna get this uh, going, maybe one snappy piece at a time. And in there. Oh, there we go. So yeah, it's some sort of update from Steam that moved all saves for some games. It affected uh, Fallout 4 as well as several other games. It had happened to me twice. Um, once all my saves were kind of missing and I thought it was just because I had too many save files in place. I think I remembered something like that uh, from quite a while ago. Uh, happening, and so I deleted some really old saves that I just didn't care about, and that fixed the problem for me for a short while. And then, a couple of days later, it came about again, and I thought I just had to get rid of some more saves or something, but uh, in doing that, that didn't seem to fix anything that time. So, oh no, I don't want prefabs. What are we looking for? Roofs. You're going to be doing, let's see, how does this line up? So, I tried a bunch of fixes that were recommended by people, and it didn't work for me, sadly. Um, I actually had to go back in and start over on 
not really start over, but I was down to where I just before I put the roads in, so I had to come back in and do the roads on this one. And then I'm also doing a build right now at the uh, sanctuary where I'm putting in um, basically a giant city. And I had lost a couple hours worth of playtime on that, build time, whatever you want to call it. Um, and it was really annoying and disheartening to, to see that happen. And so, uh, yeah, it happened to a lot of people for Fallout as well as, like I said, other games. And basically what had happened, if I got the understanding correct, is that um, Steam decided to move the saves into a Steam folder instead of uh, in my documents slash game blah blah blah. And, of course, Fallout was like, I don't see these saves anymore and so for most people it was easy as just taking those saves out of that steam folder and putting it into the my documents folder where it should be and it worked for them my problem was that my files were already in um oops wrong button my document my 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 documents folder there and it just didn't uh work and I think I'm actually going to be changing my roof line a little here because I want to do something different. Um, and so, yeah, it did not work for me. I tried everything. Um, it actually did move some of my game folders or copy them into that particular folder, but um, moving them around did nothing whatsoever. And so I unfortunately had to just kind of start over, and you're not going to connect, are you? Suck. Uh, let's try, maybe if I can get a four piece to connect. Um, maybe not. Okay, you know what, I think might be, to help me get started here. Nope, not there, maybe in the roof section. Maybe, I know I've seen it before. Of course, it's not going to be here anymore because everything's moved around. Um... Maybe in one of these premium. There we go. That's kind of what I'm looking for. These dudes right here. Let's take one of you out and bingo, bingo, bongo. That's the look I'm a going fjord. And ooh, a little bit taller, but uh, we don't need that. So let's see. What do we do it from scratch? Nah, we're gonna do it from scratch because I don't feel like rebuilding all these roof pieces and then all that. So. Let's just get back into this. There we go. So anyway, yeah, that fix uh, ended up not working for me, and so it was just go back and redo some of what I did, and that that's what it was. So I had to redo the road, but uh, it ended up being not such a bad thing because I think it came out looking a little bit better this time. I mean, if you look at their, their wall there, it's uh, pretty snazzy, so why not? You've got to find the, the positives and the negatives, right? Can't cry over spilt gin and juice, or something like that. I think that's how the old saying goes, according to Snoop Diddly Doggy, right? I don't know. Never mind. Um, yeah, so, uh, there we go. I'm going to be, like I said, uh, sort of supplying power to this thing via my water wheel deal thing that I'm going to be doing. It's just going to create the illusion because I don't think it gives off enough power to actually power all these things. Because I think what these things take like six each times six. Uh, yeah, that's. Oh, geez. Wrong button. No, we don't want that. That's. Now I'm stuck. Yeah, I'm stuck. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, and I think the water wheel only puts out like maybe ten or. 15 or something. I don't know. We'll figure it out when the time comes. Um, okay, back into roofs. Roofs. Uh, let's see. How big of a space do we have? Three wide. Um, hmm. Maybe we will do hot. And we'll just put some center and side pieces in here. Come on, snap. There we go. And we'll put a center flat piece in here. With maybe a little something different at some point. Something like that. And then for our walls, put this doer in there. And let's see, do we have any triangles? We should do. Excellent. Are you overlapping? Let's. Not. Oh, you can go over all the way. 
jerk. That's why. Okay. You two. There we go. Sure. Alright. Now we're gonna go back into our rooms. Put these guys in. Make sure these are both facing the same direction. Out of the way. Um, yep. We are good. Cool. And I might throw a little doer in the middle there to kind of snazz it up a little bit. We'll see. The old cockadoodle-doo doer. Uh, I think we have one of those, right? Let's see. In here. Like that little dude that's sitting on top of the R. Um, ha! Ah, here we go. One of these. But of course, you don't snap. Why don't you snap? That's awful. All right, let's see, how many do we have? We've got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. So one, two, three. Right, R is our, our, our. Uh, us Americans with our destruction of the English language, it's our, not R. Don't mind me. Um, back into roofs, and we want these dudes. There we go. And I'm gonna stick a light in there just to kind of Make that look nice, because it's my build, and I can cry if I want to. Something like that. Um, boop, 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 boop. So I know uh, there's a lot of you that love this series, uh, myself included, having a lot of fun doing this, and I've been getting requests for, you know, since I started it, for more videos and whatnot. And, um, I'm going to try and work that into my schedule. Um, I do have a full-time job. I work 12 hours a day, um, sometimes five days a week, so that's a lot of hours to to work, and so I don't always have, you know, tons of time to, to do this type of stuff with all the different series I have going on. Um, but I might be limiting my playthrough series because that's my least popular, so I might cut back on those a little bit to make room for... This kind of stuff, which uh, everybody seems to love. And uh, there we go. That is one Gigantosaur water production warehouse. And you're not done with it because you need some walking space around on the outside because I said so. So, uh, let's see. Let's head back to G2M construction. Actually, you know what? Let's do a quick save. And we can overwrite that one. Sure, why not? And right back into it. And let's see, back to, that? there we go, this guy here. Uh, we don't need supports just yet. Now, let's see, which way do I want this to go like that? Sure, okay. Now we're going to put a little walkway around on the outside. We're going to put some railings and all that fun stuff there, too. And... Did I miss it? I must have missed it. Go. Oh, maybe not. I haven't gotten to it yet, I guess. There we go. That's the little dude. Um, ah, there we go. Perfect. All right, all the way back to the beginning. So, um, yeah, we're going to put some walkway here, some railings, and uh, get our little water wheel going as well. We can get some power. Let's please get in there. Oh, oh, oh. Ah, never mind. Alright. Let's continue on. On to the next one. So, yeah, we're just gonna kind of, like I said, create the illusion that, um... There we go. That we have it being powered by this water wheel. I had thought about possibly trying to sneak a boat in here as well, but... With the size of this thing, um... Maybe over here, and then I was thinking maybe, too, I might put a... Uh, gate and a kind of bridge that goes up and over the gate so that said boat can get in and out. Um, if that's what you want to see, if you want to see me do that, uh, let me know. Leave it in the comments below and I will change you know, somewhere there in the center section and we'll get a boat dock thing going here and we'll put some big giant doors over there to uh, let the boat in and out. So, uh, yeah, I'll let you guys decide if I do that or not. I don't care if I pack this thing like a bunch of sardines in here with all kinds of stuff, I mean, the more the merrier, right? Um, also, uh, after I finish my build here, um, looking for some feedback for where to build, uh, do my next let's build at. 
Um, I've had a uh, request for an Adam Katz build from Anakin Palpatine. Um, not necessarily a let's build, but I wouldn't mind doing that as a let's build. Uh, I've also had uh, some ideas of doing a build at Somerville, which... Um, I think it was Somerville. Could be mistaken. Or maybe it was... Um, that place down south in the swamp whose name escapes me at the moment. Um, yeah, so anyway, um, where would you like me to go next for our next adventure for builds? There we go. So I am not going to be doing the, the concrete around the outside of this. This is going to be all done by supports like these dudes here. So uh, let me turn off surface now so we can get these guys going. Uh, this way we can actually still see the, the concrete under there if you're at the same level and this looks more like an actual dock versus just you know, more concrete that kind of defeats the purpose, I guess, the porpoise. So, let's see if we can get above the water here. Uh, yeah. So, snappy, snappy. Come on, stick with the snap. Ugh. Get in there. Things I do, they get right back underwater again. Uh, alright. Come on. That's. That kind of annoys me that uh, you drift so much in water when you're trying to do stuff like this. I mean, I understand for realism that would probably be a thing, but it's just like, come on. I'm trying to build here, you know? Let's put one there. Let's see. One right here, right? Boom! Oh, you jerk! Back down there. There we go. Alright, we want you there. And let's see. There. Yep, yep. Go. And let's see. Come on. Turn. There we go. No, I'm just gonna go through like this real fast and snap the few that do want to snap. Try to get these other guys in place. There we go. Oh, wrong way. Really? Ah, there we go. Alright, we got one. Uh, let's see, how close are we? Oh, put another one in here. Nope. Nope. There we are. There. Uh, yes, we, let's see. If we get this done, we'll get the power in place. Um, I'm actually going to be using um, electricity overhaul. I forget the full name of it, but that's essentially what it is. It's a wireless fuse box that gives off like a ton of power, enough to power basically the entire settlement. Um, and so that's what I'm going to use to actually power pretty much everything in here. Um, I might still run power lines and whatnot to give the illusion that we have, like, power going on here and whatnot. Oh, you jerk. Get over there. How dare you. Make me look bad. Alright, let's see. How do we look? Hey, not bad. I think we can use one more here because... Why not? To fill that in. Alright. Now, what about these corners? Do they look a little empty? Hmm. I mean, I could do that. Which me let's see, how does that look? I don't want the corners to be too busy looking. Let me see what else do we have. Do we have a single Oh we do. Nice. Alright. Let's uh take you out. And that's not quite what I was looking for. I want you in the corner, but you won't do that. Hmm. This one's got a little lean to it. That's kinda neat. Alright, so we're gonna take our object snap off. And how does that look? Nope, gotta fix that. Alright, let's see. Um yes, I like that mucho better. Okay, let's go do the same for all of these. I wonder if I can reach it from here. Not that one, the street one. Don't want it to look crooked so that it looks like it's gonna fall. Let's just stick you there so I can grab you and put you in place. 
stronger current here. Um, now we gotta move you over a little bit. Uh, nope, a little bit more. Right. R. Nope, still not perfect. All right, there we go. That one's that's a wiener. All right, could do the next one. I'm gonna figure out some railings for this. I might just use the the metal ones that are default in this build. Uh, let's move over a little. All right, R. Yeah. Whoops. Uh, oop. Oh, a little bit too much. That works. Okay, next one. Alright, let's see. Let's get you. How are we doing? Uh, over a little more. Oh! Perfect! Okay. So, let's see. Have these railings here. Which I suppose are okay. Oh, they got slanties too. Nice. I could probably use that for bar. Turn our snap back on. See how that looks. It's not bad. Uh, let's go back to the big dudes. Um, sure. Why not? Okay. We can have a tall slanty. Put you in place. Bar. And all the way back to the beginning there. What do you think? Should we put some crooked ones in and make them so it's not all perfect? Yeah, why not? As Bob Ross would say, maybe somebody fat like me sat on that and put a little crick in it. Of course, that's not exactly what he would say. He'd be talking about trees and say maybe somebody stepped on them when he was little and put a little crick in them. So why not? Uh, those guys in there. I'll just do, like, totally random. Break it up a little bit. Crooked guy there and there, because why not? One there. Let's see. One of those. One of those. One of them. Another one of these. One of them. Why not? And there. And I might end up uh, removing some of these as I put some walkways in place. But for now, it's just... Let's just get them here and figure it out later. That's one of the things that uh, I do often when I'm building is I'll throw a ton of stuff like this in place and then start ripping some of it out once I start putting in like my walkways and finalizing my actual design here. There we go. We now have a walk away. Oh, geez. Uh, if you've been following my channel for a while, I have problems with stairs. I fall down them all the time. Uh, sometimes in real life, too. But especially in this game. Uh, it can be like the most widest stairs, and I will still somehow gravitate towards the side and fall off. Okay. We have a water warehouse. Now we have to get some power to it. And to get my water wheel... We're going to be using Woody's Wasteland, a mod that I've mentioned numerous times that uh, is super helpful with doing awesome things like this. So, where'd you go? There you are. Um, electrical stuff, power generators. There we go. There's our bad boy right there. Um, actually, two of them. Uh, oh, this one has no waterfalls. Of course we want the one with the water, because why not? Um, so if you've been following any of my past builds, you will know that I've used this guy uh, a bunch in some of my settlements. Let's see here, give me a snap. Will, sweet! And there we go. Yeah, see, it only produces 10. And I need uh, 12 to like 36, so... Yeah, that ain't gonna... Ain't gonna do it. But it looks cool. I mean, see how awesome that is? And we have uh, a generator here doing some, some work. So... Yeah, we might have to change out a wall as well. Let's do a quick save here. Because I want to be able to connect some pylons, even though, like I said, I don't really need to run wires. I kind of want to do it just for the effect. So, let's see. Actually, let's go back to here. Because I'm going to build a little building around this, and we're going to take this railing. Um, get rid of it, actually. Because uh, we can put some walls on this thing, as well as a door some windows if we really wanted to, which uh, we might just do that. Now, let's see. Do I want to 
make it this janky looking though. Maybe I'll make it to match the warehouse, which, I mean, <laughs> with all the windows being all smashed out, it's pretty janky itself, and um, I might actually come back in and replace these walls with uh, nicer ones that um, aren't as, I don't know, falling apart as that one. Alright, so let's, let's head back in here, and I don't want a barn. Oh, is that, oh it's a separate one, okay. Um, everything kind of gets moved around because of all the mods I have going on here. And, uh, of course you don't want to snap the wing. I want you to. So, let's pick you up, move you out of the way. And there we go. Perfection. And so we have glass. Do we really want glass, though? And, no, we want this to be a little more well protected, I would think. Alright. Let's see... Um, do I not have a full solid ball? No, I do not. Alright. Back into the other one, then. Oop, nope, wrong one. I mean, well, hang on. There's some stuff in CVC. Let's see. Uh, some metal. Shacks. Wooden. Vanilla. Warehouse. Walls. Let's see, what do we have? That might be kind of fun. That, uh, ew, no, that doesn't work. That's too big. It's gonna stick out. Alright, onward. Um... Oh, I see. These are smaller, because that's... Yeah, alright, so let's do that instead. So that it fits that one pre-existing wall. Alright, so now I need a short door, which... Uh, there we go. No, no, oh, you dirty rat. I'm going to have to redo that again. Alright, let's take you, put you there. There we go. Now we need um, a roof that is not on fire. 10,000 interwebs if you understand and get that reference. Um, showing my age a little there. I kind of want to angle them, but how does that look like? Ooh, that's really close. And that sticks out. So we're going to have to veto that one and maybe put in a pre Abbed roof, which uh, there are none in there. So let's go back into here. Here. Barn and warehouse. Back to the warehouse. Uh, not that it really mattered, but uh, let's see. Prefabs. Do we have. Looking forward in here? Nope. Over to the roofs. Looking for Yeah. One of these dudes. Which, of course, doesn't snap. Because why would it? So we'll just kind of. Have to finagle this one in place. And let's see. Hey, not too shabby. I like it. Cool. Um, but we still run into the problem now of getting that out of there. Hmm. We might need to get rid of that wall. Hang on, let's see. Go back into CVC and warehouse walls and let me see if I have one that has what I'm looking for alright, these are not gonna work uh, ooh, that's terrible do I need to have a hole in it? <laughs> I mean, kinda what I need, but um, yeah now we're kinda having a problem here I mean, if I see, I go to take a wire from here that doesn't exactly work, but I have an idea. Hang on. Let's go over here. I had to think about where the stuff was. I, like, never use powered, wired connections anymore. Um, one of these guys. Let's stick one here. Boop. Hey. Let's just do that. There we go. Let's see if we can make that connection. Ah, oh, it won't let me. I mean, we'll, ha we'll make it work. Right? Yeah, so here's how you get around that type of stuff. So, take your connector, put it in place where you can connect it, make your wired connection, then you glitch that bad boy up there, and boom. Oh, well, okay, not boom, because <laughs> it looks stupid at the moment. But there we go. I mean, it works. We can possibly even change out the connector to one of these guys. Let's see how... 
that's not exactly what I want. Um, all right, let's stick you there for the moment so I can make that connection. And then let's take you. There we go. Got it. And stick it right here. And uh, yeah, nah. unless we do something. Oh, you're going to be. Let me see. Turn that on. There we go. That uh, helps sometimes. Do that. See, now it looks like it's coming right out of that hole. Alright, so let's get rid of that guy there. And let's uh, clean that up a little bit more, maybe. Um, we might have to do a little change here. Alright, let's get rid of the wire at the moment. And let's put in another wall connector. Whoa! Here. And let's put that guy... here a little better. So we don't have such a strong angle. And then, of course, yeah, we're gonna have to grab you, put you here, so I can make that connection. Oh, man, I'm starting to remember why I hate wire connections so much. Oh, uh, alright. Look at that. That is beautiful. Is that what it's connected? It does. Okay. And we got some holes here. We can, uh, we can make that work, right? Of course we can. Alright. Let's, uh, save. I hear a storm coming in, so... Let's... Go into... Oh, that's why I'm all the way on radio for that. And... Let's bring up our cheat terminal, so I can get rid of the storm, and maybe... Get us a little more sunshine, too. Go to game alterations... Alterations! World... Weather... Clear... And... There we go. That'll stay clear. Now let's change it so we have some more sunshine. More light. Uh, world. Do, do, do time. Go down to time. And let's make it... Noon. Yay! There we go. We got some light. Okay. Alright, let's see. Um, Alright, let's put uh, another connector in place. I want to use... I have them. Uh, these are actually kind of neat. Might use some of those indoors, but that's not what I'm looking for at the moment. Um, yeah, one of these bad dudes. These are really cool looking. Um, I think I'm going to have to shrink it. Ooh, no, maybe not. Alright, let's turn on our surface snap so I can see just how tall this thing has to be. Alright. So. Hmm. Hmm. This could be a problem here. Maybe not. Maybe I'll use those just indoors then. Maybe I'll just put another one of these guys. Um, I have an idea. Let's put one of these guys in place. Uh, let's turn off that. Nope, turn that off. Turn that off. And put you there, sort of, but... <laughs> Let's, uh, no! Where you, where'd you go? It disappeared. Alright, let's turn that off then. There we go, that's better. I want to use that hole right there to make our new connection. Oh, you can actually kind of see him sticking through there. Alright, and... Maybe I won't get to use those guys. Hmm. Yeah. Uh, put you just so I can make the connection. Oh, you won't do it. Alright, so we'll just... Whoa! He moved. Let's just do that. Yay. Oops. Yeah, we gotta turn our snap back on to make that work. Nope, 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 nope. There we go. Okay. And then we'll stick this guy right like that. See? Now he's going through the hole again. We are kicking butt. Okay, now we have to get all of these connected. Um, I'm thinking because of where the power connectors are, where are they? Yeah, they're here on the side, so we might want to go like up and up. I was thinking about trying to connect them all in sequence to each other, but that 
isn't going to function properly because they're gonna like put the wires through each other. All right, so let's put one of these bad boys in place for a second while I figure out what I want to do here. Um, I mean that kind of that kind of works. Um, yeah, let's do that. All right, then it looks like we have our fuse box facing down here towards the uh, machine. But if we need it, we can just flip the switcher. And we'll have this one face this way. Maybe. Alright, let's connect you. And let's get our sequence going this way. Connect all these guys in. Why are you saying you have no power? Everything's connected. Right? Oh! I don't have that connection, dummy. <laughs> Not that it matters again. But there we go. They are lit. Um, no comments other than don't do drugs, kids. Very bad. Uh, how does that look? It's pretty close to the ceiling, but I think that it's okay. And then... So, oh, our other connection's down here. Um, yeah, so we got to put another one down here. Let's get you over here. And let's make our connection there. Alright, now we can connect that one. And that one. Oops, wrong button. And that one. Alright, now those three are connected. But of course, only one is getting power because our little mill there doesn't make enough juicy juice. So, we will fix that uh, momentarily. In the meantime, let's get our other connectors in place. Um, actually, hmm. Hmm. Let's see. Let's put you here, maybe. It's going to be a little different on this side because we're, our connections are facing the opposite direction because I yeah, put everything facing the other way. Maybe let's do that. Oh, that does that. Ugh. Hmm. Yeah, that kind of puts that pipe in the way. Let's see. It's not the end of the world. Just, let's see, let's get this a little more lined up. And, yeah, I kind of like that better. Because then I can just leave this one here as, um, you know, same as that guy over there. We'll face you that way. So we can get everything kind of universal. Um, sure. That works. Because I say so. Over there. Alright, let's uh, nagle you a little better. So. Cool. Alright, last one. You in bar, right? Oh no, you're way over this way compared. Let's see, you go over the line here. Oops. So. Right. Uh, oh, a little more actually. I'm gonna keep these even. But of course, I gotta make sure that you, yeah, don't do that. Not that it matters, but I don't want it to do that because I want it to look pretty. Um, and you guys are two. Two look kind of even. How are you guys? Um, you should be a little more like that. There we go. Okay. Good enough. That floats my goat. Alright, so we want you to be bought. Right. Um Oh no, I put two more here. That ah, okay. Down a little how does that look? Uh maybe a little schmidgen more. Oh, okay. Connect you to there, you to there. You all the way over to there. Oh, don't tell me you're not going to do a long connection like that. Ugh. All right, let's do that. Connect you. Really? Oh, is it because you're sticking up into the ceiling now? All right, let's do that. Let's try that. There we go. Okay. 
Now we're kicking butt. And you guys are connected. On to the next one. There. And one final one here. Right. Yes. Over into the corner. And your solid connection. And your connection. And you. And finally you. Alright. Now let's get you over to where you should be. So each one has its own personal cut off. Bring you over just a smidgen there. And perfect. Now we're also going to need some steps coming down here. Um, real fast. G2M. Um, let's see. Hmm. Skybridge. No. Covenant scaffold me. Yeah, we got these guys. Oh, but you're a little too short and you're a little too long. Let's uh, try one of our old faithfuls and go to the just regular concrete, maybe. Let's see, so there is uh, oh, there isn't a in between. You can always just do that type of deal. I mean, that kind of works. All right, maybe we'll have to see if I can find. Oh, if I can remember where. You are the, um, yeah, quarry steps. Uh, let's see. Might just be in, like, miscellaneous. Um, do -do 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 fittings, no. Miscellaneous. Let's see. Do I have anything here? Probably not what I'm looking for. Okay. Um, maybe, uh, Home wrecker. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Actually, there is not that. I thought there was a other shorter step, but I'm probably not gonna find it in this one. Um, let's see. Floor. It's not helping. Um, nope. 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 Um, all right. I have one other idea. Let's see. Back into structures, not concrete. Um, yeah, let's try. Let's try these guys here, not those. Uh, that's too long. Shoot. Yeah, it is the quarry ones, and I don't remember off the top of my head where they be. Um, I always find the darn things when I am not looking for them. Uh, let's see. Are there stairs in this one? I don't think there is. I mean, there is, but not what I'm looking for. Hmm. Snappy. I think Snappy might even have some corn stairs somewhere. But I think... No. Yeah, one of these guys does. I see it, like, all the time, and then I'm like, Oh, yeah, there it is. Uh, let's try back in here again. Um. If you know what? I'll try Kuro tab. I think somewhere in here is kind of what I'm looking for. Uh, nope. Nope. Hmm. Linus, maybe. Probably not. Yeah. Oh, what was that? Oh. Actually, you know what? I do have an idea. Hang on a second. Let's go back into... Oh, uh, maybe... Here, there we go. But not these, um, not those, not that, or that. Must be one of the others <laughs> that has a peer as well. Um, let's go back into G2M and back over to peer section and stairs. Let's see, I'm looking for. Ah, that'll work. Perfect! Alright, I'll take it. So we can actually get down here if we need to. Versus just hopping up and down. We now have some stairs. And, um... Alright, now, I had mentioned before about actually pumping out enough electricity in here to power all of this. So, we are going to go to generators. And... 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 There's the wireless fuse box. Look at that. Puts out 
what is that, 10,000 gigawatts. So we just gotta stick this somewhere. Maybe we'll put on one of these machines, maybe? Or maybe, you know what? I have an idea. Let's, boop. Let's stick it in here, maybe make it look like it actually serves a purpose. Boom. So now we'll take it and shift it down and we'll get rid of that and connect to there and then we'll connect to there. We don't have to actually connect that because it is wireless power, but at the same time now it does just in case not everything works with that, um, but just in case we actually now have full power in here. And I want some lights. Um, I'm just going to use some of these basic lights. I don't really care too much. Uh, let's put on our... Oops. Put that back on. And let's get some lights in here to actually see what we're doing. Uh, let's see. Get about here. Oh. Sit so. And we'll put a light bulb right there. And we'll put one maybe on every crack. Every butt crack in here. That'll help us space them out evenly versus trying to find the middle of each one. Which is what I usually do, so... We're just going to kind of cut some corners and do it this way to make it a little simpler. And now we have some juice flowing, we have some lights, and we are making water, which means we are going to be water rich soon. And let's see, there's another crack. And one lower one there. And one there, and one last one here for the outer perimeter there. And of course we gotta put some way up there as well to as I said so. So let's go ahead and get our light going. And we'll put one there, as I said so. And we'll put one let's see. Here. Cool. And we'll just keep going along. Um there. That looks right. And let's see. Oh, look at that. It's actually sticking through the ceiling a little bit. That's cool. Doesn't make any difference because, I mean, I'm going to put its own light in there as well to make it shine. Stick you there. And let's see. Turn you around this way as we get dizzy and disoriented. Um, there. And let's see. There. Oh, jeez. Wrong button. And we'll put one... There. I mean, it's not exactly even. <laughs> or is it? What did I do? Uh, let's see. We had a space of two on that side. And we have a space of... Uh, two. Okay. No. That, that works. Cool. So now we have some light. Uh, in the future, we might put some work lights in here, and we might put some more uh, machinery that makes it look like it's actually doing stuff. And um, kind of disappointed that these don't make any noise. It's a little too quiet for my liking. I like uh, when I'm doing this kind of stuff for there to be a hum going on. So um, and maybe I'll look into putting something in there for that. And uh, let's see, where's my light? There we go. I'd like to put one right in here to make that glow. Perfect, I think. Right. Yeah. That works. Cool. Alright. We have completed, more or less, our water warehouse. We uh, just need a door, and like I said, I'm going to put some stuff in there to make it make some noise, because I want it to sound like it's actually doing something. It's way too quiet for my liking. So, um, we are moving along. Um, for the corners here, for my... Guard towers. Ooh, I gotta fix that. That's nasty. Uh, for my guard towers. Um, I think I'm gonna build a completely different guard tower in each corner. So I have the pre-made one over there. I have the one over there that I built using thematical and practical. And I think I'm gonna kind of do the same thing with that one and that one to uh, make each one very unique. And I might even, for maybe this wall here put in its own little guard tower about halfway through and if I do put in the gates, if you guys want to see me do the gate thing with the boat um, I will put uh, some guard towers right there as well, one guard tower on each gate and we'll have like a full bridge in here 
that goes up and over so that the boat can get in and out. The whole big shebang. So uh, let me know if you want me to do that, and um, we will get into that. And uh, also in the next episode, we'll probably start building some of our houses and walkways on the water and eventually start doing our houses, our, our houses <laughs> over there. Uh, thank you again to everybody for the suggestions that you've been making, and thank you for watching and supporting me. Really appreciate it. Uh, real quick note, if you want some Spooner D swag, t-shirts, hats, hoodies, and stuff, um, there's a link in the description below. Feel free to get one and be the first person on your block to have one so everybody can say, who the hell is that? Um, yeah, and uh, until next time, don't get irradiated.